Hey yo, thanks for tuning in to Celeb Source Back up, backing you up with the information that matters to you Hey yo, check this out, man um, uh, Lil, Wayne, Lil Wayne has said that he don't remember the Carter, two, uh, the Carter 3 He don't remember the Carter 2 He don't remember what socks he had on when he performed a milli He not even sure that's the name of the damn song He said this, this is what he said He said, quote, I'm gonna be so honest with you I don't know the, the Carter 3, the Carter 2 the Carter one from the Carter four and that's just my God's honest truth You can lie you can ask me about such and such a song I wouldn't even know what we talking about so it holds no significance to me at all I don't even know if that's when the Carter three came out That's how much I don't know I work every day bro every single day and also always Look at it as a curse part of the gift and part of the curse I believe that God blessed me With this amazing mind But would not give me an amazing memory To remember this amazing-ish <laughs> Close quote Hey, I get it, man I feel the same way I feel the same way I got an amazing mind, Wayne I do, I really do I just don't remember what the hell I, I, I was thinking And then by the time it comes out in words It's all gobbledygook you see what I'm saying? And none of it is good. You know what I mean? It's like so-so. It's okay. It's all right. You know what I mean? It's not like breaking boundaries or brat barriers and stuff like that. I get it. Okay? You don't remember that TPS report you did 15 years ago. I get it. You know what I mean? <laughs> Look, you, you remember that colostomy bag you helped that patient with? How about when you dropped off that Amazon package a few months ago? You remember that? The customer remembers when they got it. But you don't remember delivering it. I get it. I see students all the time. I'm like, please don't show up to class on tomorrow. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? They're like, oh, I graduated three years ago. You know what I'm saying? Look, I just saw a student at a basketball game. I don't remember her. I don't even remember whether she graduated or not. All I remember is she was bad as hell. She was like, I done been graduated a long time ago. I'm like, oh my gosh. Ain't that crazy? Anyway, look, look, look. Remember, um, uh, what's my time looking like on this one? What, what's my time looking like on this one? All right, too. Check this out. Check this out. Check this out. Remember, we told you the other day that Blueface got arrested. Check this out, man. The police report obtained by TMZ states in on May 29th, um, inside the Palms Casino. Uh, let me see if I can pull it up here. Um, inside the Palms Casino. Come on, can you pull it up? I got it, bro. Just take it easy. Don't start yelling at me again. Well, then why don't you got the damn thing up? I have it now, bro. Gosh. According to the police report, okay? Blueface, his pregnant girlfriend, Kashawn Rock, and several others in their entourage are accused of assaulting a woman. That's right, I'm reading this straight off of Academics page. Uh, he posted, cops say the woman walked up to Kashawn, professed her love for the reality star, congratulated her on her pregnancy, but also proclaimed she didn't give a damn about Blueface. And she added, cuff him for good measure. According to the report, Krishan didn't appreciate the verbal jab at her man and punched a woman in the left side of her face. Cops say that Blueface then snatched her phone and said, this is mine now. Officers say the woman, and then he put it in his back pocket. The woman was able to get her phone back from Blueface. She probably got his number two, but claims another man in the entourage clocked her with an uppercut. Fellas. Are we really beating on women like this? This is crazy, man. Anyway, um, Blueface uh, uh, allegedly kicked the woman in the face and in the chest until security intervened. And then they fled in a, a Dodge Charger. I was about to say a Charge Dodger. Um, uh, yo, let us know your thoughts in the comments below, man. Is it okay to hit a woman? I think the answer is hell no. You ain't supposed to be beating on no women. You're like, well, what if, what if, what about if they lined you up or something like that? I mean, you know what I'm saying? What if, what if, you like, what about if they hit you? Well, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like, you like, well, what about, what about if they slapped you in front of? I'm, 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 I'm trying to give you an answer. You know what I'm saying? Um. I don't believe you should um, hit a hit a woman at all. You know what I mean? I don't believe you should hit a woman, man. Yeah, I, I, look, yeah, I even think a woman can get away with a slap. You know what I'm saying? I do believe in turning the other cheek. So she slapped you one time, you turn the other cheek. But she slap you again. Now I don't got no more cheeks. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> uh, but but 
I would say don't do anything that that results in a girl jumping on your head. But sometimes, you know what I'm saying? Sometimes they be getting all hyper emotional. Just leave. You're better off just leaving. You know what I mean? Let us know your thoughts in the comments below. Be sure to like. Be sure to subscribe. Um, thanks for tuning in to Celeb Source Backup. Backing you up with the information that matters to you.